now, we have the section that we even call power user tools, but these are pretty nice. I'm gonna talk about how you can double tap uh, title bars to uh, quickly resize them. I'm gonna show you just our just start typing feature and some uh, of the ways that you can use our select all search results feature. All right, so the first one is double tap title bars. This is if you're, for example, viewing two documents in parallel uh, and you say, I wanna focus a little bit more on Douglas Engelbert here. You can simply double tap the little title bar to make this larger or double tap the other one to make it larger. This is a small gesture, but it just makes it easy if you're working with a lot of documents, especially three or four at once, you don't have to go and resize and move them around. You can simply double tap. And in fact, I'll show you this if we bring up a third document here. We want to focus on the material safety data sheet. We double tap, it gets bigger. Then we tap America, uh, stem cell best practices. It gets larger and tap, tap Engelbert, it gets larger. So very easy to do uh, to work with multiple documents at once. Next is just start typing. Just start typing is a terrific feature where I can simply start typing and liquid text will show me different options for what I can do with that text. So for example, if we just start typing STEM as in stem cell, it gives me options for doing a, for doing a search in the document, doing a search in the workspace uh, and jumping to another document that has that word in it. On the other hand, if we start typing, let's say 15, there we are, go right down to page 15. So uh, depending on what you type, it brings up different options for you. Uh, we likewise have this for, uh, for selections. So if I select a piece of text here and I type, this is important. It gives me options such as adding a new comment, creating a tag, as well as standard options for search. We'll create a new comment. And you see, it makes the comment and just puts it right there for me. Saves me one click. Uh, finally, if I wanna, let's say, add the tag important, I select the text, I type, and you notice it already has the tag important because I created it earlier. So I simply click apply and it applies the tag to what I typed. So this is great for power users who wanna work in a more keyboard centric way rather than having to use their mouse or their touch screen all the time. All right, so this is just start typing. Finally, select all search results. This again is definitely a power user feature, but it's one that we love. So if we go over to, let's say or we're in our, uh, let's say, yeah, we're in our American Stem Cell Association best practices. Let's say we wanna find all the examples of uh, the word, uh, concerns. So we'll do a quick search for the word concerns and only one, that's not very interesting. Let's do a word search for the word stems, the phrase stem cell. And in this case, it found 194 results in this document. Well, let's suppose this is an important search and I'm gonna to wanna to be able to get back to this search again later. I can actually save it by doing this. I can go to select all search results. And now it selects all instances uh, of or all the things that it found in the search. And now you see, I have a few different options. I can create a comment. I can auto excerpt all these uh, word, stem cell words. I can copy a link to them. I can highlight them. I can tag them. In this case, I'm simply going to create a comment and say stem cell results. And we'll just pull this off into the workspace here. And now we'll end our search. And let's say later on, I wanna get back to all those results. I can simply tap the link button here and you see the document collapses itself together and brings up links to all those different search results I had earlier. When I'm done, I simply tap the little X up here and they will, and it goes away. So this is great for saving search results. Let's say uh, uh, fetal and there's seven results. And let's say we tag, we go to select all and we can highlight them, but we can even tag them, which I always like doing. And let's say we tag these as uh, uh, already read. And now you see right there, we've, uh, we've just applied the tag. And at the same time, we can go and uh, immune. Let's see how many results we have. Only three, but still gets the point across. Select it and, we and let's instead highlight this as uh, bright red. And here you have it. So we have immune in bright red, we have fetal and kind of pink. And just like you said, and in this case there, I didn't select very many things, but it'll work, uh, it'll work great no matter how many you have. And the idea of this again is if you, uh, if you wanna very quickly be able to identify certain words or phrases in your documents and just highlight every instance of them, 
uh, this is very convenient so that later on as you're scrolling around, you can immediately see, oh, wait, fetal right here, immune right here. And you don't have to uh, constantly do searches for things that are important to you. And the last one I'll say is you can, uh, you can also pull out all tagged things as excerpts. So we know that some people like to work in a multi-phase or like to do their document analysis in multiple phases. And so in one phase, they like to do lots of highlights and tags. And in the next phase, they like to pull things out and organize them as excerpts. Well, Liquid Text actually supports this workflow really well. And the, uh, the searching, the uh, select all really helps with this. So for example, let's say we do a tag search for everything that's listed as important in this document. And we have five and you see those five are, you know, different, are different important pieces of text here. I can go to select all and go to auto excerpt. And you see what it does. It pulls them all right out into my workspace. So this is great. It means I can first do all my tagging and then pull things out into different workspaces and organize them when I'm ready. Okay. So again, power user, user tools, double tapping title bars, our just start typing feature and select search results and all that you can do with that.